get over you? I don't know, like, he just keeps texting me. Over? Oh, that's it. Oh yeah. my god, that hurts. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Hi, Vanessa. Hi. Who are you? <laughs> you don't know? Wow, you're an idiot. I'm not. Can it, loser? But do you really have AIDS, or is it just another way to get attention? You're such an attention slut. <laughs> Shut up, who are you? Are you crying? I can't believe the attention slut is crying. Shut up. Listen, let's be honest. Nobody really likes you. Who the hell are you? You're such a loser. Please stop it, please. You are such a loser. Such a loser. You're so pathetic. So pathetic. Just shut up, just shut up. And you know I'm telling the truth. That's why you haven't logged off yet. Bye, Nessie. I hope you dig a grave early. What? Because you wouldn't want your non-existent social life to have a shallow grave. Bye, Nessie. Who are you? Your worst nightmare. And it's only gonna get worse. TTYN. <laughs> Cyberbullying is using the internet to harass or bully others. It can be extremely damaging. The fact that it occurs every day on websites like Facebook and MySpace is a new phenomenon. Teens have committed suicide due to cyberbullying. One case is Megan Muir, who was cyberbullied by 40-year-old Lori Drew on a fake MySpace account. Another was Ian Steele, who was bullied both online and at school. Lori Drew was recently acquitted because the laws concerning cyberbullying are extremely unclear. Based on the statistics found at www.cyberbullying.us slash research, girls tend to cyberbully more than boys but not far behind. 19% of girls surveyed say they have bullied someone and 16.1% of males have, bullied, have cyberbullied others. According to the same website, about half the victims have thought about suicide after an incident. Cyberbullying is a serious matter that seems to affect students as well as adults. Don't do it. Don't join in because it can easily destroy someone and you and you can end up in court or in jail.